everyone and welcome to the park. So this morning I woke up, I went to the post office and then I went to Poundland to get this amazing throwing ball device which Bonnie absolutely loves. Um, then I went back, got the dog and now we're out walking her. So feeling really refreshed because even though it's cold out I'm warm because she was pulling me the entire the entirety of the way here so I'm quite warm and refreshed like my face is cold and my body is so hot oh Bonnie I can't pick it up there we go but yes it's a really really nice day even though it's really overcast and foggy I kind of like it it's actually not too hot and not too cold except if you're in my room which is just sub-zero <laughs> I think it must be because I don't move around much in my room I just sit at the desk and do work so maybe that's why I'm always cold uh, Bonnie is waiting for me to pick up her ball, aren't you, Bod? Yes, you are. Look. Left hand. That was pretty good, actually. <laughs> for a left-handed throw. So anyway, today the plan is to actually go around and visit my granddad because he's like in his 80s and I think he gets lonely. So I'm going to go and visit him today for an hour or two, have a cup of tea. Um, I probably won't film that though because, I don't know, <laughs> it won't be very interesting for you and I don't think he'll understand it, so I'm going to leave that bit out of my day. But then later on I have to do a ton of work for Etsy, make loads of new things for Christmas. Because <sighs> I want to get a good Christmas style going, make some Christmas items and I found these amazing things in Poundland which I'm going to turn into even cooler things, I'll show you later on. Hopefully if I get round to it, but they're really, really cool, trust me. If you're like into D&D or if you're into like nerdy dice games, yeah, there's a hint there. It'll be good. And I also actually do need to go to Hobbycraft today again. I swear I live in that place. I need to get a board because I started making vinyls and I want to like get a big, um, get a big board to display them on basically. So yeah, that's my day so far and I will catch you up in a bit. <laughs> okay, shit like that is really, really creepy. I've just walked up to the weird little gym and this thing's just swinging in the breeze all by itself, quite strongly as well. What the hell? Mate, even ghosts are fitter than me. <laughs> it's still going. That's really bizarre. Oh, let's go around here. It's so weird. These things aren't even electronic. They're meant to be like manually powered by like your body. I swear to God, if later on I'm editing this and there's something on there, I'm freaking out. <laughs> I'm gonna like freak out so bad, I'm gonna scream. <laughs> it's still going. Should I touch it? I'm gonna touch it. Ugh, okay. Stop. Okay, and you know what, like, the, the, the weirdest thing about this is there's literally no one else in this park other than me. I'll show you. Like, look. There is absolutely no one here. This park is mine. No one at all. So, that's bizarre. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk around again, like the entire of the park with the dog. And if I come back and that's moving again, it's definitely haunted. Oh. Okay, so I've come back and it's not moving, so it's definitely not haunted. But there are people here now, so I'm going to go. So I thought I'd take the chance now to catch up with you. Basically, I went to the post office to pick up a little parcel um, here. But the annoying thing is I can't show you what's inside because it's actually a present for George for Christmas. Um, I will make sure to show you the overall thing that I'm making him though. So I will show you guys that, I promise. I'll get a clip of it and then show you after I give it to him because I might have to give it to him before Christmas. 
so a couple of presents there for him just small bits and bobs nothing extravagant um and i'm now at my granddad's but i'm not at my granddad's i went up and knocked and i called his home phone and i could hear it ringing and i was like fine he's not in then i tried calling his mobile and his mobile's ringing from inside the house as well i was like looking for the letterbox and now i'm worried <laughs> like where is my granddad he's like mia um so i don't know where he is and he's really he's like 86 i think or 88 he's old like he's elderly and he can't get around much anymore so now i'm like where is he what do i do um so yeah i think what i might do is try and call him tonight when he's more than likely in and then actually arrange to come around and see him because i didn't actually arrange this it was more of a surprise but yeah <laughs> So I've also just found out that my mom is coming home early because she just texted me as well. She's coming home early because last night, this is a weekday by the way, she, she, her and dad just stayed up drinking wine watching Peaky Blinders and they came into my room about 12 and I was like, wait, you're not in bed yet? Yeah, they came into my room about 12 and they were so drunk <laughs> and they went to bed. Mum came in again to my room about three in the morning because I was watching some YouTube and she was like, go to bed now and I was like, okay you too you've got work in the morning <laughs> and she's just texted me now saying she's never drinking again heard it all before <laughs> but anyway <clears throat> she's now on her way back and she's gonna work from home this afternoon so i might have to go, might have to go get her from the station momentarily <laughs> quite bummed the granddad isn't in i kind of wanted to get all my like seeing people and stuff out of the way today so i could focus tomorrow on sculpting but it should be all right i go see him tomorrow for an hour. We'll have tea. Tea in the morning or something. Mm. Okay, I'm going to go now. Because I've got to go get a mother. <laughs> I've turned into like a chore lady, I swear. I just wanted to like stay home and make YouTube stuff and do like work. But nope, chore day today. So it is now 2am. I don't know when I last updated you, but I watched a the first episode of Stranger Things with my parents. I wanted to show them that. Um, they might have fell asleep on the second episode, so I'm gonna catch up with what spot. Yeah, I'm gonna catch up with them later and watch like one every night, I think, because when they get in from work, they're too tired. So, did that, and since then, I've been staying up making loads and loads of vinyl stickers for Etsy. So, my evening hasn't been that interesting to be honest. So, I'm going to say night now, and I will see you guys later. Bye!